What's up, guys? Matt Murphy here back at Stick Library headquarters for sticklibrary.com. Welcome to this next lesson in our beginning drum series set of lessons. And this is going to be on uh, basic music notation. And uh, we already talked about eighth notes, but there are some other uh, note values that I'd like to talk about. And in this particular lesson, I'd like to talk about quarter notes and how to count them, eighth notes review and how to count them, and then we're going to move up to 16th notes and how to count them. So I'd like to review all this. Um, basically, the eighth note is the subdivision that most people are going to kind of latch on to uh, very quickly. Again, one and two and three and four and now. The numbers are quarter notes. So four, right? There are four quarter notes in a measure of music. So here's the quarter note. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now I'm going to go back and forth between quarter notes and eighth notes. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. One and and two and three and four and so you can hear that the pulse is the same the pulse is the same here we go again quarter notes then eighth notes one two three four one and two and three and four and one two three four one and two and three and four and I hope you're doing this with me three four one and two and three and four and one two three four one and two and three and four and now let's make up a neat little exercise same thing that I was counting is what we're gonna play now so it's gonna go right left. You're just going to alternate hands. That's all you're doing, okay? So first we're going to do quarter notes, one measure. Then we're going to do eighth notes, one measure. We're going to go back to quarter notes, one measure. And then we're going to do eighth notes, one measure, and a tap. And again, I'm going to use this Aquarian True Balance practice pad to uh, silence the snare drum so you can hear the articu articulation of the stroke and you can also hear me counting. So it's going to make it a lot easier for you to understand what's going on as I silence the bass drum, okay? Or silence the snare drum, okay? So again, here's this exercise. Series of quarter notes, four. Series of eighth notes, eight. And a series of quarter notes, four. Series of eighth notes, eight, okay? I'm gonna do it once for you and then we'll do it together, okay? Here you go. One, two, ready, and go. And one, two, three, four, one and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one. Again, as we've all talked about up to this point, maintaining a good fulcrum. I'm maintaining a whipping motion in my stroke, a nice full stroke being played in the center of the playing area or the playing surface, okay? So let's do this exercise together, guys. Uh, again, quarter notes, eighth notes, quarter notes, eighth notes, tap. Here we go. One, two, one, two, ready, and go. And one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, full strokes, one, and two, and three, and four, and whipping motion. Whip, whip, whip. One and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and tap. Okay, let's speed that up just a little bit. And I know you know that I'm forgetting something, but we're gonna add that here in just a minute. So I haven't forgotten it, it just hasn't been added yet. Okay, here we go, a little bit faster. One two, ready, and go, and one, two, 
three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and tap a little bit faster. Ready, and go, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and tap two more times. Ready, and go, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and tap. Just a little bit faster. One, two, ready, and go, and one, two, three, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one. Okay. So now, what I have not added into this exercise yet is what is called 16th notes. So, let me explain what a 16th note is here real quick. Quarter note is four notes per measure. Then we subdivide that into eighth notes. So now we have eight notes per measure. Okay? Now, the next subdivision up is 16th notes. So there are 16 16th notes in one measure of music. So for every quarter note, there are four 16th notes. Now this is how they're counted. One, E, and, a, uh, two, E, and, a, uh, three, E, and, a, uh, four, E, and, a. Uh. The numbers are the quarter notes. The ands that I'm saying are the eighth notes, and the e's and the uhs are the sixteenth notes that are being added into this pattern. Okay? So, very quickly, I'm going to count you off. We're going to go very, very slow, and we're just going to play a series of sixteenth notes, okay? And again, it's just going right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Okay? The count off is going to be in quarter notes. We're going to play the exercise in sixteenth notes. So, you're going to hear my subdivision, and then just play along with me. All right? Have some fun with this. One, two, one E and a two E and a ready and go and one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one, two, three, four, one and two and three and four and one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. Okay, so I gave you all the subdivisions that we've learned up to this point in a measure through that exercise, okay? Once again, four sixteenth notes for every single quarter note. So that's one E and a, two E and a, three E and a, four E and a. Okay? Let's do this again. One, two, with me, one, Two, ready, go. One E and uh, two E and uh, three E and uh, four E and uh, one, two, three, four, one and two and three and four and one E and uh, two E and uh, three E and uh, four E and uh, one. Again, this is Matt Murphy at sticklibrary.com. Thanks for coming for this lesson. Join me on our next lesson when we increase the speed on these 16th notes and really start having a ball with some of this stuff. Thank you.